hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new design tutorial today so let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notification at first go to the file and take a new artboard which is the 2000 pixel by 2000 pixel and giving the name and you will get the artboard and after that take a background from here from the rectangle take a rectangle which is the size like uh, 2000 pixel by 2000 pixel as like the artboard and hit the create button or ok button after that turn off the stroke turn on or give the color like this and here align to the artboard select these things and take in a middle after that i'll lock it up and i'll work with this background and uh, take a new layer after that go to the polygon tool from here polygon tool and write down six for the hexagon or you can write down three whatever you can write down you'll get that type of uh, gone like a hexagon heptagon like that i'm writing here three and uh, 200 pixel or 500 is good it okay and after that change the color like uh, i'm giving this stroke white type stroke and stroke thickness like 10 that's fine and if you need you can make uh, these smaller like this and press the shift button and hold it and just drag it like that after that you are getting like this type of things and i'll increase the stroke thickness like uh, 40 pt yeah that's fine and change the stroke mode from here in a round like that so you can like this or this that's good it's round rectangle and after that select all the things press a from the keyboard and p from the p from the keyboard and select once here select once here and select once here so i'm taking three things and again a selection direct selection tool and select this anchor point and delete these things it will delete or you can delete these things as well okay fine you'll get you'll getting the gap over here and after that i'll just make it reverse how to do that right press and go to the transform and reflect from here make a copy over here select the vertical reflection and make copy and after that right press again transform reflect and now i'll take the reflection like this and hit ok and now i'll use the arrow key and shift key to making it like that so you're getting a minimal logo after that you need to change it out like a object and expand and hit ok then the stroke will get or convert into the shape and press ctrl or command g you'll get another minimal logo like n or you can rotate this one you'll get the z or z whatever it is hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and if you have any kind of question query request please do comment in my video comment section until the next video i may say i'll be signing out today bye bye